Hello friends, welcome to Prep Harmony, where we believe education should be our fundamental right and knowledge should be free for all. I am Kritika, your mentor who will be bringing to you a lot of videos for all competitive exams. Please subscribe to our channel so that you can get the videos. And also press the bell icon so that you get video notifications. Please share with your friends so that we get motivated to bring you more knowledge. Let's grow together and prepare in harmony. Welcome again. Pastoral and farming communities of the Neolithic phase in Indian prehistory, cultivating the landscape of change. The Neolithic phase in Indian prehistory, spanning roughly from 7000 BCE to 2000 BCE, witnessed a profound shift in human subsistence strategies. Marked by the transition from nomadic hunting and gathering to settled agricultural lifestyles. This transformative era laid the groundwork for the emergence of pastoral and farming communities, each contributing uniquely to the cultural mosaic of the subcontinent. 1. Nomadic Pastoralism and Early Neolithic Movements In the early stages of the Neolithic, nomadic pastoralism played a significant role. Mobile communities, relying on herding animals like cattle, sheep, and goats, moved across vast landscapes in search of grazing grounds. Evidence from sites like Mirgar in present-day Pakistan reveals the presence of early pastoral communities engaged in animal husbandry. 2. The Agricultural Revolution and Sedentary Farming the advent of agriculture during the Neolithic period marked a revolutionary shift from nomadic lifestyles to sedentary farming communities. Cultivation of crops such as wheat, barley, lentils, and chickpeas became central to these communities. Sites like Koldihua in Uttar Pradesh provide archaeological evidence of early cultivation practices. 3. Balancing Pastoralism and Agriculture Certain Neolithic communities found a balance between pastoralism and agriculture, engaging in mixed subsistence strategies. This hybrid approach allowed for the benefits of both animal husbandry and crop cultivation, contributing to the resilience of these communities in diverse ecological settings. 4. Diversity in Neolithic Farming Practices Neolithic farming practices exhibited regional diversity based on environmental conditions. In the northwestern regions, including Baluchistan and parts of Punjab, wheat and barley cultivation thrived, while in the eastern regions, rice became a staple crop. This diversity showcased the adaptability of Neolithic communities to varied landscapes. 5. Emergence of Settled Communities The Neolithic phase saw the gradual emergence of settled communities, abandoning the nomadic lifestyle. Semi-permanent and permanent dwellings, constructed from materials like mud bricks, became characteristic of Neolithic settlements. The site of Burzon in Kashmir provides insights into the shift towards settled habitation during this period. 6. Neolithic Pottery and Artifacts Neolithic communities left behind a rich archaeological legacy, including distinctive pottery. Black and red ware, a prevalent style during this era, displayed intricate designs and often served both utilitarian and ritualistic purposes. Artifacts like stone tools and grinding implements highlight the technological advancements in Neolithic material culture. 7. Social Organization and Neolithic Burials As communities settled into more permanent lifestyles, social structures evolved. Neolithic burial sites, such as Brahmagiri and Karnataka, reveal insights into the social organization and possibly hierarchical structures within these early agricultural communities. Grave goods and burial practices varied, indicating diverse cultural beliefs. 8. 
Environmental Impact in Neolithic Land Use The shift to agriculture had notable environmental consequences. Deforestation occurred as Neolithic communities cleared land for cultivation. Balathal in Rajasthan showcases evidence of terracotta figurines, possibly linked to rituals associated with fertility and agricultural practices, reflecting the interconnectedness of culture and environment. 9. Regional Variations and Neolithic Cultures Neolithic cultures exhibited regional variations in material culture and subsistence strategies. The contrast between the Chalcolithic cultures of the Deccan Plateau and those of the northwestern regions highlights the nuanced adaptations to distinct ecological niches during the Neolithic phase. 10. Legacy of the Neolithic in Indian History The Neolithic phase laid the foundation for subsequent historical developments in the Indian subcontinent. The agricultural revolution initiated during this period set the stage for the rise of complex civilizations, shaping the trajectory of human history in the region. In conclusion, the pastoral and farming communities of the Neolithic phase in Indian prehistory represent a pivotal chapter in the narrative of human evolution. The transition from nomadic lifestyles to settled agricultural communities not only transformed subsistence strategies, but also laid the groundwork for the intricate tapestry of cultures and civilizations that would define the historical landscape of the Indian subcontinent. 1. Mirgar's nomadic pastoralism In the early Neolithic, sites like Mirgar in present-day Pakistan reveal the significance of nomadic pastoralism. Where communities relied on herding animals like cattle, sheep, and goats. 2. Koldihua's Agricultural Revolution Koldihua in Uttar Pradesh provides archaeological evidence of the agricultural revolution during the Neolithic. Showcasing the cultivation of crops such as wheat, barley, lentils, and chickpeas, marking a shift to sedentary farming. 3. Baluchistan's Hybrid Subsistence Strategies Neolithic communities in certain regions, like Baluchistan, found a balance between pastoralism and agriculture. Adopting mixed subsistence strategies that incorporated both animal husbandry and crop cultivation. 4. Diverse Neolithic Farming Practices The Neolithic witnessed diverse farming practices across regions. While wheat and barley thrived in northwestern areas, rice became a staple crop in the eastern regions, highlighting the adaptability of Neolithic communities to varied ecological settings. 5. Burzom Sedentary Communities The site of Burzom in Kashmir exemplifies the emergence of settled communities during the Neolithic. Characterized by semi-permanent and permanent dwellings constructed from materials like mud bricks. 6. Black and redware pottery, Neolithic pottery, such as the prevalent black and redware style, displayed intricate designs and served both utilitarian and ritualistic purposes. Offering insights into the artistic expressions of these early communities, 7. Brahmagiri's Neolithic Burials Neolithic burial sites, like Brahmagiri in Karnataka, provide insights into social organization and hierarchical structures within early agricultural communities. As evidenced by variations in burial practices and grave goods. 8. Environmental Impact at Balathal the shift to agriculture during the Neolithic had environmental consequences, as seen at Balathal in Rajasthan, where evidence of deforestation is observed. Terracotta figurines found at this site suggest connections between cultural rituals, fertility, and agricultural practices. 9. Chalcolithic contrasts, regional variations in material culture and subsistence strategies are evident during the Neolithic. 
with the Deccan Plateau contrasting with northwestern regions and Chalcolithic cultures. These differences highlight nuanced adaptations to distinct ecological niches. 10. Legacy in Indian History, the Neolithic phase, with its agricultural revolution, laid the foundation for subsequent historical developments in the Indian subcontinent. The shift to settled agriculture set the stage for the rise of complex civilizations, leaving a lasting legacy that shaped the trajectory of human history in the region. Crafting quality educational content is a substantial investment in both time and resources. Your support, no matter how modest, can be a powerful catalyst in accelerating our content creation process. You can donate us by scanning the code below and help us as little as you can. Thanks in advance. Dosto, hum log shiksha ko desh ke kone kone tak muft pahunchana chahte hain. अगर आपको हमारे वीडियो से कुछ भी सीखने को मिला हो और आप अगर हमारे शिक्षा मिशन में सहयोग करना चाहते हो तो नीचे दिए कोड पे स्कैन करके हमारी मदद कर सकते हैं इसके लिए हम हमेशा आभारी रहेंगे